another unbook like feature of the iBooks platform that opens a lot of creative possibilities is audio. iBooks Author supports audio and it's pretty easy to add. You can either use the media browser, which is in the menu bar under View, Show Media Browser, and click on Audio. And this shows you everything in, that you have in your iTunes library. Or you can just drag a file from the Finder. But in either case, there's a catch, which is that you have to use the AAC format and only the AAC format. And that is any file with the M4A extension. So if your file is not already the AAC format, you're going to have to convert it, which you can do in iTunes really easily. So I'll show you that. So you go over to iTunes and first click iTunes preferences in the menu bar and then import settings and you want to make sure that under AAC encoder you're using iTunes Plus that's the quality that uh, Apple recommends so I already have that so I click OK OK this is the file I'm going to convert it's uh, an interview I did last year with a friend of mine about his mobile greenhouse project so then we're going to click advanced create AAC version and now it's converting it. And this is an 18 minute audio file and it's only going to take about 10 seconds it looks like to convert, which is pretty impressive. Almost done. Two seconds left. There we go. So let's click on it. Get info. And yes, this is the AAC version. So this is the one that I want to use. And we can see it's got the M4A extension. Totally cool. Right click on it and show in finder and there it is and it's got see we can see it's got the mpeg4 audio it's a different file than the other ones and now all I have to do is show my, okay iBooks author and just drag it right in done okay so there it is so this is sort of large and ungainly so I'm gonna resize it and this little box can be uh, manipulated just like any other box or any other object rather in iBooks author cool let's play it So that works. That's all you have to do to add audio to an iBook. It's quite simple.